Hey guys, welcome back to K-Popish. Before we begin, make sure you subscribe to my channel to be updated in the K-pop world. On December 25th, Mamamoo performed at the SBS Gayo Dejon. The group performed their latest single Aya, whose music and music video is influenced by South Asian and Middle Eastern culture. In the intro of the performance, a clip is played, which a Twitter user 52 Desangs said is the azan. The azan is a call to prayer in the religion of Islam. The Twitter user was found to be an army and a blink and called Mamamoo out for cultural appropriation. A lot of Muslim fans then stood up and clarified that it does not sound like the azan at all. A Twitter user MMM4+ then posted a thread clarifying that the background music that Mamamoo used in their performance is a sample music from the Middle East Essential series by Geo Israel Set. which is available on Splice. Splice is a royalty-free platform that offers music samples that everyone can use. After finding this out, fans banded together to trend the hashtag apologize to Mamamoo. The Twitter user 52 Desangs then posted a screenshot of receiving an email from RBW Entertainment which said that serious action will be taken against them as RBW received numerous reports from fans. Fans were quick to deduct that the email was fake and RBW does not send out emails like that. 52 Desangs then posted an apology saying I sincerely want to apologize for what I did. I never meant for Mama Moo to get attacked in any way. It was for others to know and help them understand better. As soon as I realized that this might be a misunderstanding, I deleted the tweet. I hope you can forgive me. I am sorry for the hate Mama Moo got because of me. It was never my intention. I am really sorry. The user then went on to deactivate their Twitter account. Apparently, the user reactivated their account again to tweet. Anyways, I'm deactivating again. Just wanted to tell you all that you successfully made my next year bad. Hope Mama Moo disband next year. Cheers. And then deactivated the account again. A Twitter account by the name of Celebs Arabic with over 300,000 followers also wrote an article against Mama Moo based on what 52 Desangs tweeted. However, they also later deleted it and issued an apology. Fans are still furious as there have been a number of Twitter users spreading false accusations against Mamamoo. The group constantly receives hate and insults on a daily basis for absolutely no reason. Hwasa especially receives an unbelievable amount of hate and fans are sick and tired of the group having to go through all this time and again. Anyway, that's all I have for you today. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and do not forget to press the like button. Also, leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.